have breaking news from JAM concerning admission for 2021 JAM candidates. My name is Ola Vitangod, aka MCO Blue. Please, subscription to this channel is completely free. If you have not subscribed, please click on the red subscribe button just below this video and turn on post notifications so that I can get alerted immediately when we publish any new updates. Now, the Joint Admissions and Matriculation Board on Tuesday cancelled General Court of Mass for admission into tertiary institutions and gave schools the freedom to set their individual minimum benchmarks for admission. The board took the decision at the 2021 policy meeting, which was held virtually and chaired by the Minister of Education himself, Adamu Adamu. The summary of the JAM policy meeting is as follows. 1. The Joint Admissions and Matriculation Board JAM has adopted minimum cut off marks sent by tertiary institutions for admission into universities across the country for the 2021 2022 academic session. The JAM Registrar Oloyode, while displaying the minimum cut off marks, also announced that universities are not allowed to go below 120, while polytechnics and colleges of education are not allowed to go below 100 for admission. However, this does not mean that all universities must lower their cut off marks to 120. It only gives schools the liberty to reduce their cutoff mark but must not go below 120. Secondly, it was agreed at the meeting that the total fee for post unified tertiary matriculation examination, usually known as post UTME, should not exceed 2,000 naira. Although they warned the institutions not to go beyond the peg fee, adding that candidates should not procure administrative charges. Thirdly, on the deadline for the closure of admissions, the stakeholders resolved to allow the Education Ministry to decide as they could not agree on the December 31st, 2021 deadline for all public universities and January 31, 2022 for all private institutions. Stakeholders also adopted the 2021 admission guidelines which provide that all applications for part-time or full-time programs for degrees, NCE, OND and others must be posted only through JAM. The meeting approved that for direct entry, the maximum score a candidate could present is 6 and the minimum is 2 or an E as required by law. Now let's take a look at some universities that have released their own cut-off mark right now. We have University of Medjugorje who released their cut-off mark to be 115, Usman Danfodio University released that to be 140, University of Sokoto 140, Pan Atlantic University 210, University of Lagos 200, Lagos State University 190, Covenant University 190. However, for Bayero University Kano, they have set 180 as the minimum cutoff marks for all programs. However, they have decided to set 160 for the blank candidate that applied to the university. Departmental minimum cutoff marks for other departments in Bayero University Kano include Faculty of Allied Health Sciences have a cutoff mark of 200, Faculty of Clinical Sciences MBBS have a cutoff mark of 250. Faculty of Dentistry have a cut-off mark of 200, Faculty of Pharmaceutical Sciences 220, Faculty of Law 220. We are not so sure of Uniben yet, but from the past, the minimum cut-off mark is still going to be 200. Let's wait till it unfolds. Now, that related object, it is important to remind you all that the University of Ibadan is not admitting candidate for the 2021-2022 academic session. Therefore, if you chose UI in this year's jam, you are expected to do a change of institution to another school that offers your preferred course. So this is what we have for now, but we'll share more information as it unfolds. We want this channel to be very interactive. If you have any questions concerning what we just posted, do well to drop them in the comment section and I will personally attend to them. Please like and share this video so that others can see it. And of course, I will see you in the weekly roundup on Sunday. Bye.